Hi Marcus, I'm Phil from Lewis Reed. Hi, yeah. Hi, yeah. We're just going to do a demonstration of the Mercedes Vito 4S yep. driver vehicle. Uh, before we make a start on the demonstration, am I okay to take some measurements? Yeah, with you? yeah, no problem. Thanks a lot. So we are 115 in height. Ninety and length. I'm sixteen. Bit. Thanks for that, Marcus. No problem. So we're going to make a start on this. So yep. the Vito Torre, so the drive on vehicle, is all independent. Mm -hmm. You'll have a controller that will be wireless that will be able to open the tailgate, and you will also be able to control all the lift that's in there deploying it and putting the lift away. Right. For today's purpose, I'm going to open the tailgate for you and here's a wireless controller for the lift. Okay. To start this, if you just press up and down together and I'll open the tailgate for us. Right. So, with regards to the Vito Torre, everything's electrical mm -hmm. to help for your independence for yourself. That will also include electric side doors as well as electric folding mirrors on the side okay so if you can keep your finger on unfold, unfold for me yeah so the amf lift comes out you'll see the two handles the handle either side just to help with regards keeping stable when the lift takes you up and down okay if you keep your finger on down, down for us and then in your own time once it's fully on the floor You'd like to come on, sit centrally for us, please. Yep. And apply your brakes, and then keep your finger on the up button. Now, your finger will notice firstly on the vehicle with the Mercedes. Lewis Reed's been able to put in what's called like a roof scoop. Yeah. It's about two centimeters, but that extra two that's two centimeters makes a massive difference with regards to wheelchair users coming in mm -hmm. and their head height uh, so if you can come just to where my hand is please while i take some photographs if that's okay yep and in your own time marcus if you enter the vehicle and just position yourself behind the front passenger seat thanks no problem Marcus, now you're in the vehicle. If you, when you come to position yourself into row two near your side, yeah. that's this position here. You'll see at Lewis Reed, we legally have to provide you with a set of pins. Yeah. Uh, so you've got a set of front pins here that will lock onto the front of your chair and a set of pins on the back that will lock onto the rear. That's for if you are with somebody and you're traveling as a passenger, they'll be able to tie the seat down for you. If you are driving independently and leaving your chair here, at stage two, who do your hand controls, they can also fit an independent locking system yeah. that will position itself on the seat pillar with the seat belt. Okay. So, when you're coming up and you're ready to do your transfer, this is the Braun six-way seat. Right. The controls for the seat are here at the left-hand side. Mm -hmm. You'll see the three switches. The first switch will move you frontwards and backwards. Yeah. The middle switch will adjust your height up and down and the third switch will pivot your chair to go left and right okay so if you want to bring yourself up and yep. have a go with the transfer onto the six-way seat okay so that one to go back yeah yeah and then middle one will do the height right so the, this the first one, one will pivot to right. the left There you go. Right.
okay. You okay? Yep. There you go. Right. So once you're comfortable, yeah. if you do the back switch, switch free, that will pivot you straight round so you can't go no further. That will then align you up centrally for the steering wheel. Right. So I'm going to put this uh, forward. You get yourself behind the wheel where you're comfortable. And then what we'd ask Marcus is when you're comfortable behind the wheel, if you can just fasten your seatbelt for us, please. Okay. Where we also mentioned about hand controls and doing a independent tie down for your wheelchair mm -hmm. one other good thing that you could also have fitted onto the vehicle again through stage two is your seat belt having a clip on the handle here right. so it would sit here ready for you to just put across your body if you find that easier okay That's something you can speak to stage two about right once you're behind the wheel obviously you're in a good eye line level mm -hmm. you can see you look comfortable in the vehicle so some things about the vehicle that comes with it yeah uh, firstly you will have what's called standard as apple carplay you've also got android phone it can work on that's the center console mm -hmm. so you plug your mobile phone in basically once that picks up your mobile phone it will then use this screen as mm -hmm. like your mobile phone screen so you can go handy for if you need to use google maps yeah or ways if you've got spotify music playlists on your phone that can be played through the center console system yeah it comes with cruise control that's this lever underneath here okay. as well as a speed limiter right uh, you've got automatic lighting which is down here uh, you've got your side folding mirrors electric side doors as mentioned earlier you will also have limousine glass around the rear of the vehicle 90 percent mm -hmm. that can come standard you get air conditioning uh, on the front of the vehicle that blows through to the back part uh, also if you were to get the vehicle through the motability scheme you will get what's called fire trace you can also privately purchase it if required that's what this gauge is here basically what fire trace is is in the bonnet of the car yeah there's a fire extinguisher fitted by lewis reed right. so if your engine was to overheat at all uh luckily i've never heard of it having to be applied but mm -hmm. if it did and it goes over a set temperature the fire extinguisher system will go off in the engine allowing you time to get out of the vehicle safely right okay so you will get that with the vehicle as well that's good mind that's really good i do like that okay uh, so, obviously the steering wheels multi-functioning yeah so it's bluetooth as well right so obviously you can do your call speaking into the vehicle you've got your multi-functioning buttons on the wheel and yeah that's the features that come so how did you find your demonstration today i thought it was brilliant yeah you seem to really, be able to really do good. everything well you've done your transfer well you've got into position did you find it easy very it's going, this will give me, and I bet it gives so many people so much independence. Oh, it really does. Just to be able to get into something and not to rely on someone else. That's it. Like I do at the moment with my chair. Someone's got to get it from the boot of my car for me. Yeah. So being able to just come and go whenever I want to, it's, it's great. It's all about making your life easier mm. and, and having a nice vehicle to go with it as yeah. well that and you can get about in. It is something that looks really nice as well. It's not, I wouldn't say it's your you know everyday sort of van and no. to think that you know you can get something like this without having to spend ridiculous amounts of money to get something that is really nice yeah and it comes with a lot of features as well which i think is really is a bonus it's really good yeah it is it well, is i'm really i'm pleased you like it any questions yep. um no i don't think so just uh, there might be one actually what kind of colors does this come in so so you've got a lot of metallic colors that come in you've got the likes of your graphite gray you've got your black You've got your hyacinth red, which mm -hmm. is a really nice colour. Uh, what I would advise is we will leave you a brochure. You can have a look and you can see the colours for yourself and the other mm. parts of the specs of the vehicle. However, if you have got a Mercedes dealership somewhere nearby, mm -hmm. I would always advise a customer to just go. If they've got half an hour to an hour spare time, 
just go and have a look yourself because okay. you'll see the difference of the vehicle once you're up front to it and you'll get a better true image of the colour yeah. than looking in a brochure or, or on a screen. Okay. I will have a, have a look later and because like, I know there is a uh, Mercedes dealership somewhere. Not in far. relation to your interior, if you were doing a private purchase, mm -hmm. you can actually make the seats inside go to a, what's called leverette. Right. Uh, if you're going on the motability side, on the grant side of it, these will be the seats, which will be the fabric okay. ones. Okay. But okay. I think you'll agree that the fabric are just as. I kind of say that good. normally I do go for a leather seat or a leatherette. Yeah. Um, but I've got to be honest, this is great. Brilliant. Really, really good. Well, would you like to go for the test drive? Oh yes, please. Yeah. No problem. Be able yeah. to get going. Great. Thank you very much.